When it comes to major cast members leaving a show, the rookie fans have multiple traumas. At first, it was Mercedes Mason who played Captain Zoe Anderson. In episode 16 of season 1, Zoe died unexpectedly in the line of duty. As she was a main character up until that point, no one really had anticipated this moment. You might have thought this happened because the actress wanted to leave the show, but no. It was the writer's decision to kill Zoe off. The showrunner Alexi Hawley said that Zoe's death was the most dramatic and powerful way to impact the story. Some people were furious because Zoe was a strong, accomplished female character who was scrapped for a male character's development. Another departure happened with Afton Williamson, who played Talia Bishop. But this time, things were more complicated because it was Afton herself who wanted to leave The Rookie, and her reasons created great controversy. The actress said she left the series because of racial discrimination, sexual assault, and bullying she experienced on The Rookie set. In a lengthy Instagram post in August 2019, Afton detailed the length of things she experienced on set, especially the sexual assault allegedly committed by The Rookie guest actor Demetrius Gross. In a later private investigation by producers, Demetrius was exonerated, but the issue is still being debated. Yes, another departure happened after that. Perhaps the most heartbreaking exit happened when Jackson West, portrayed by Titus Macon Jr., was killed in season 4's premiere episode. This time, Titus left the series for his personal reasons. It turns out he was not happy with playing a black cop, but not addressing the issue of systematic racism in the police force. Even though the subject appeared in one episode of season 3, this was probably not enough for Titus. That's why he left The Rookie. Now, The Rookie fans are faced with another potential departure. But this time, the stakes are even higher. The person in question is Nathan Fillion, who plays Nolan, the literal main character of the show. The Rookie in the title. Is he really leaving? These rumors started when Nathan landed a significant role in an upcoming movie. The established director James Gunn is making a movie for the DC Universe called Superman Legacy. The film's cast members were announced a few days ago, and Nathan was among those names. He will play Guy Gardner, one of the Green Lantern superheroes. The movie will start its production in January 2024. James Gunn also confirmed that this would not be the only project where Nathan will play Guy Gardner. He will appear in several DC projects. But how will this impact Nathan's involvement in The Rookie? The showrunner Alexi Hawley answered this question on Twitter. In response to a headline about whether the new movie would delay the rookie season 6, Alexi said, Nope, and closed the subject. But this was before the actors' strike began. The strike started by the Screen Actors Guild is expected to continue until the end of this year. This means a rookie won't be able to film anything until then. Suppose Nathan starts filming the new Superman movie in January. In that case, he won't be available for the rookie for months, which is terrible news for the show's fans. Earlier this year, ABC announced that The Rookie Season 6 would come out during the mid-season period, sometime between December and May. The Rookie's fate is uncertain since the filming probably won't occur this year. I'm assuming Nathan's presence is necessary for The Rookie Season 6, so the show may be filmed after he is done with Superman. This could take the sixth season's release date to a much later date in 2024, even 2025. This results from the recent strikes, which are expected to affect major films and TV shows. Recently, projects like Deadpool 3 and Stranger Things 5 were halted due to the strikes. For now, it's not certain how much The Rookie will be impacted. At least we know Nathan is not leaving the show, even though his role may cause a delay in the release date of The Rookie Season 6. What do you think about cast departures? Who is your favorite character that left The Rookie? Tell me in the comments below. Don't forget to like and share this video. Subscribe to next season for more videos like this. See you soon.